Hello, this is Joyce, and I'm just sitting here. I need to be out and about, but I was just sitting here, and I was pulling out some of my Biggs dies that I bought a couple years ago. Went into Michaels one day, and they had all of these dies for three dollars and four dollars, and I got this one and about four or five others. And this is the tattered poinsettia. And I had never played with it. I opened the package for storage and to make it easier to pull in and out. But I had never really used it. So I decided to pull out some papers. And I started with what I'm playing with are some of my glitzy glitter papers. So I used one of the green ones out of this um, glitter paper. And that's what they look like. Real smooth. And then I used a couple colors of this um, foiled stack. And I love it because I'm going to do something with the purple. It's got purple and it's got blue and it's got green and red and gold and silver. So I played with or pulled those out. And as you can see, I've used four different sheets of paper. And this paper, this glitter paper, has like a plastic backing on it. And as you can see, I should have ran it through a couple more times because that one didn't come out. So I'll use those and go back and punch out the papers that I can save. And, I mean, they are nothing fantastic. They are, sorry for the shine. But I put three berries on there just because it was, um looked funny but that's one and I used three of the different colors and I think I'm gonna add some more berries to these two I don't know if I'm gonna use them or not but I just wanted to play with it and see what they would look like I really since it's Tim Holtz I think I'm going to go and uh, actually I kind of beat up the the foil ones so that they weren't so shiny and I use my little tool and rubbed around the back to kind of make them a little more distressed and they probably need a little bit more but that is my second one and then this is my third one but yeah I'm going to add some more of the um, bl red bling in the center to make it more like a berries in the middle of it and I didn't beat this green one up as much as I probably should have but those are my poinsettias I'm going to do some more like I said out of vintage music paper maybe or out of uh, out of uh, music paper from uh, one of my pads, but I just wanted to share these with you. And like I said, I'm going to add a couple more uh, pieces of bling in the center to make them more look more like they actually have berries in them. But yeah, just something I've been playing around with since I'm home. I need to be running some more errands, but you know how we do. And I got an appointment later on. But anyway, so those are my poinsettias. Oh, that'll make them look better if I just kind of bend them up and bend them that way and, you know, make them look like they're not so shiny. Yeah, that'll help. Oops, lost my bling. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. Um, like I said, I am going to... Put some more of the bling in the center just because that one came out. And then I'm going to add some more and then let them dry. So thank you so much for watching. Just thought I'd share that little project with you. And I'll be back soon. Bye.